Hello everyone, it's Laura here. I uh, have not been on YouTube for a very long time. I'm still watching a lot of Pekka's videos, but um, I just haven't been making my own videos. And I'm hoping to get back into that again this year because it was something that I really did enjoy doing. And um, yeah, so I'd like to be part of, part of making those videos again, which would be a bit of fun. Um, I'm on holidays from work at the moment, school holidays. So I've got uh, one more week off. I've had one week already and I just wanted to share what I managed to find in the last week that I've had off. Um, not very many good pickings. It's been pretty slim pickings at the op shops where I live at the moment. Not much is available. Um, seems to be very heavily picked over. But I've got a few things so I was going to quickly show you. Show you some things I got. Got this Skylander bag um, just for a dollar. I'm going to put it with my son's Xbox One characters you know the little character pieces that you put onto the boards i'm going to put it with that just to make it look a bit better uh, i got this fatua bag it was four dollars it's leather um it looks to have never been used I had a look online they seem to go for about 50 on ebay but um i don't know if anyone else is experiencing this <clears throat> excuse me but uh, my ebay sales have been shocking um the last six months really really bad um i've been trying to sell things on to the facebook group so i've been selling a lot of things there but even that slowed down a lot um i just can't seem to move the stock that i do have quick enough um so that's really why i have scaled back on how much i do pick up because um it just doesn't move quick enough this is another bag i got a pony uh, label bag that was five dollars um yeah i'm trying trying to get some more bags in when i do see them i got this one it should be from about the 90s i think for early it's got its original tag this was four dollars as well um get the plaque there so it's a bit of a funny color i don't know if it's a really popular color but i like the fact that it had its tags on as well i got this little bag here got this one on friday actually crossbody um christian Serigano, new york it's not you know amazing web or anything but um as you can see i've already put my stuff inside the bag so i'm using that one for a little while because my other crossbody bag that i used to go to the op shops has actually broken so that came in handy i went to one of my favorite op shops the other day which I don't get to go to very often because it's in the opposite direction like I work, where I work I would go the opposite direction to get home in the afternoon so it's nice to go on the holidays and they always hold bags of jewelry for me and um, this is nearly three kilos worth of jewelry most of its costume um, newer pieces there's a couple of vintage I haven't really had a look yet they only charge me five dollars five dollars for this massive bag of jewelry which is fact that's fantastic sometimes i actually find really good pieces in it um i've actually found a christian dior set in one of the bags they've given me a bracelet and a necklace which was very cool just a couple of cds a dollar um i actually lost my blue album from the beatles double disc for a dollar so i was very happy to pick that one up again just some oakley sunglasses they were two dollars I also got these stone silver interlocking bangles um, stamped stone silver with the maker's mark I need to do a little bit of research on they were 50 cents um, also picked this up on Friday it's just a very simple bangle I like the circle design stamp CR for country road paid two dollars had a look online it retails for $79.95 so I'm just gonna keep that one for myself um, not the best condition there's a bit of mark on the hardware here. This is Oriton leather wallet and um, I paid a dollar for it. These usually sell well for me in the Facebook groups. You can get 10 to 15 so it's a quick easy turnaround. And I also got this necklace here and this is by Mimco which is quite an expensive brand here in Australia. Um, I've had luck selling their bangles before so I'll see how I go with the, the necklace. 
Um, I hope everyone's having better sales than I am at the moment and probably and even better pickups. I hope everyone's having better sales and better luck at the thrift stores than I am. Um, everything just seems to be a lot harder at the moment on eBay. Sales are down, um, interest from buyers is down and um, generally I'm just feeling really disheartened with the whole eBay process and I've been on eBay for um, 15 years now so um, it's never been this hard or this bad to sell before. Um, there's always been consistent sales daily and uh, right now I'm lucky to make a few sales a week. So um, I need to try and change my game plan up a little bit. I'm not sure really how. Um, with working full time and I'm studying three subjects as well this semester at uni. So I'm pretty much doing a full study load as well full time. Um, time for me is quite restricted at the moment but um, at the end of June I'll be finished my exams and um, I'll just have to concentrate on work then, not studying as well. So hopefully I can sell more on this side there again. But um, I hope everyone's having a good day and uh, finding good finds out there and making some good sales. Looking forward to making my next video and catching up on more of everyone else's picking videos. Thanks for watching everyone. Bye.